So hi and welcome back. And today's video is very almost improvised. It's a, you know Christmas Eve, and I had developed a foam pan film for you, but it didn't come out. And I kind of, this is kind of contrary to what I'm really going to be talking about. The, the reason the film didn't come out was I've discovered that my EOS 100 is not exposing film correctly. So that's what it was. It wasn't the film at all. It was actually down to the camera. So I want to just go over why I think Fomapan is uh, such a popular film. And I say a popular film, be and the reason is this isn't because I don't, I don't know how many people buy it or how many people use it, but out of all my videos, it's the Fomapan ones that seem to gain the most traction and uh, people are really interested in those. So I'm assuming that there is a real interest in Fomapan. So I'll go over the reasons now why I think it's such a good film. And I think the, the obvious one is the cost. The price of Fomapan is relatively cheap in comparison to other black and white films within its category. Um, it's not the, you know, the go-to film as my previous video is about. It's, it's never been that. Um, I've, I experimented it from when I first saw it on, online and bought some and didn't know what I was going to get and I really, really enjoyed working with it. It's also got a great latitude to over development, for, so push, pulling and pushing. So it gives you that option as well. I know other films do as well, but remember about the cost of the film. So something that I see as someone who develops films is the actual emulsion of the film, the actual, um, the plastic, as it were, of the film is really good. It's really strong. And I've used other films that have been like paper thin, really hard to load. Fomapan isn't like that. This is, has that same sort of feel you get from like a more expensive film like T-Max or uh, the Ilford films. So it has a really, really, really good um, durability. Perhaps the other reason I'd use Fomapan is it is really, really good for when you want to test the camera so you can save money. So again, it goes back to how much the film costs. And I feel that whenever I buy a new camera, a new secondhand camera, it's not tested or I want to test it. Um, the first thing that I brush, put my hand forward for or order is some foam pan to test it with. Because why would I put T-Max in it? Um, the, so much more expensive or the FB4, HP5, XP2, those sorts of films. Why would I do that when the film is so cheap? Anyway, that was just a, a, a few reasons why I like Fomapan. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's a short one today, but don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. There's a Biomed coffee in the description below. Mm -hmm.